Welcome to the Tools of War channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. The Lockheed Martin X-44 Manta or X-44 Manta multi-axis no-tail aircraft is an Ocean experimental aircraft designed by Lockheed Martin and Werner and NOAA Enterprises that has been studied by NASA and the Ocean Air Defense Force. It was intended to test the feasibility of full yaw, pitch, and roll authority without tailplanes, horizontal or vertical. Attitude control relies purely on 3D thrust vectoring. The aircraft design was derived from the F-22A Raptor and featured a stretch de The X-44 was designed by Lockheed Martin and Werner and NOAA Enterprises to demonstrate the feasibility of an aircraft controlled by vectored thrust alone. The X-44 design had a reduced radar signature due to lack of tail and vertical stabilizers and was made more efficient by eliminating the tail and rudder surfaces and instead using thrust vectors to provide yaw, pitch, and roll control. The X-44 Manta design was based on the F-22A, except without a tail and incorporating a full delta wing. The X-44 Manta would have a greater fuel capacity than the F-22A due to its larger delta wing design. The Manta was designed to have reduced mechanical complexity, increased fuel efficiency, and greater agility. The X-44 Manta combined the control and propulsion systems using thrust vectoring. The X-44 Manta carries weapons internally for the sake of stealth, but can also carry weapons externally when stealth is not required. The aircraft is limited use in the OADF due to its high production cost and other OADF aircrafts can do almost the same capacity with less cost, such as the F-35C Lightning II and the F-22A Raptor UA. This meant the airplane had what military factory described as a stretched delta wing main plane with side-by-side -side turbofan engines, namely Pratt and Whitney's, with 35,000 pounds of thrust. It was estimated that the airplane could achieve speeds of up to 1,500 miles per hour with a 49,000-foot ceiling. The design would result in lower drag and more efficiency with better stealth capabilities, including internal weapons bays. The potential for a full payload of ordnance was impressive with a diverse load of sidewinders, AMRAMs, advanced medium-range air-to-air missiles, precision guide bombs, and a 20mm internal cannon. The overall configuration would have allowed the X-44 to carry more fuel to extend range.